What's up guys, Steve here with another unemployment update in regards to the LWA program. So yesterday we saw FEMA approve another state, putting us at a total of 45 states now approved, and we now have seven states that are distributing out these funds to their claimants. In addition to that, it looks like next week we're gonna be seeing a new bill put out by the Senate that will propose extending the FPUC benefits. So in this video, I'm gonna be covering all that, along with going through all of the states and their anticipated distribution dates so that way you can know when to expect this money to hit your bank account. And if you guys like that, if you could do me a quick favor, smash the like button, it'll just take a second. I would appreciate it. YouTube success is pretty much based on interactions, so when you smash the like button and leave comments, it helps out my channel. Thank you so much. And today I'm gonna to be doing something that I've never done on the channel before, and that is I'm gonna be uploading three videos today. This one on unemployment, one on the eviction moratorium that's gonna be taking place. If you or somebody you know is facing that, watch that please because it doesn't just apply automatically and also one on the current status of stimulus talks there's a lot unfolding now so if you guys would like to stay up to date on all of those go ahead hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell and also if you don't get notified know that i'm going to try to get all of those up today before 5 p.m pacific standard time i'm ready i've got my coffee let's do this and first i want to shout out my viewer community and say thank you for keeping me up to date and responding to comments specifically today i'm going to shout out my new york viewers uh, I'm not gonna make you wait till the end of the video. I'm gonna give you an update right now. So uh, it turned out that at the end of the month of August when Governor Cuomo decided that he was gonna be a part of the LWA program, that a lot of viewers let me know that they could expect to see the money around the 6th or the 7th of September. Well, yesterday, a lot of New York viewers let me know that that was not the case. They said there was a new update, and I did confirm this on the Department of Labor's website for New York and also on recent news reports, saying that New York systems are gonna require a couple of weeks to implement this LWA program. So that's the most recent update. I know it's probably not what you wanna hear, but I'm not gonna sugarcoat anything. I'm gonna give you guys the most recent updates. And also too, those of you that said the 6th or the 7th, I did track down the source of that. You were correct in assuming that. However, I found out that I think that source is not staying up to date and current like it should be. I saw some old information on there. so. Just wanted to let you guys know that, give you that update. And also there was a couple people from New York that were upset with me saying like um, that I was leading them on, that I was getting their hopes up or I was giving false information. I wanna let you guys know, my intention is to give you guys the most recent information and it's changing pretty frequently. So I'm trying my best to stay on top of it. And please let me know if I say anything off and just know that my intention is to help. So, uh, Thank you for your patience. I will continue to update you guys. And that is your New York update. So the new state that was approved by FEMA and is now the 45th state to be a part of the LWA program is Delaware. Also, we now have seven states distributing out these funds and those states include Arizona, Louisiana, Missouri, Montana, Texas, Tennessee, and now Massachusetts. Now, some viewers said they are getting this. Some said they aren't. I found out it might be determined by whether or not you're collecting PUA or regular unemployment. So. Keep an eye out for that, but it's supposed to be going out here very soon for Massachusetts if you haven't received it already. Now, all states approved by FEMA to be a part of the LWA program will be distributing $300 per week to their claimants with the exception of a couple states that said they will contribute an additional $100 on top of the LWA so that way their claimants can receive $400. And those states include Kentucky, West Virginia, Vermont, Kansas, and Montana. Now, in order to be eligible to receive this LWA benefit, according to the executive memorandum, you must be collecting one $100 per week from your unemployment benefits before taxes and you must have lost your job due to the pandemic. So this is unlike what we saw with the FPUC benefit where pretty much anybody that lost their job due to the pandemic was receiving the benefits. This one is for $100 per week or more. Now this is to be retroactive back to August 1st according to the executive memorandum and it's supposed to last till the end of the year or until funds are exhausted. Well, FEMA let us know right away that they couldn't last till the end of the year. As a matter of fact, they could only guarantee three weeks. However, now they're saying three, four, or maybe even five weeks for some states. However, keep in mind that if that's from August 1st and now we're in the first week of September, that that's almost the full amount right there, the four or five weeks. So uh, this is only a temporary fix. Now, the good news is that stimulus package negotiations are rolling out. We're gonna see a next, another bill next week. I'm gonna talk about more about that in a video later today. And that FPUC benefit should hopefully go to the end of the year, if not longer. And it's unlikely we're gonna see the $600 per week that we saw before. However, it could probably be maybe around $400 or $500. As details are released, I'll be sure to let you know, but it looks like 
Hopefully the second round of FPUC will be coming out here soon. All right, so now let's go through the states and their most recent distribution times as of today, Thursday, September the 3rd. And just a reminder that South Dakota is the only state that has opted out saying they're not gonna be participating. And also Nebraska is the only state that we're still waiting to hear from. Now there are four states that are currently pending approval. And those states are Nevada, New Jersey, uh, Kansas and Washington DC and Nevada is saying four to six weeks after approval New Jersey is saying that they're gonna need an entirely new system and that this could be out until October Kansas I still don't have any information and Washington DC no information as of yet so now let's go through the list of approved states and if I misread anything or if I give some information that you have an update on please let me know in the comments below let's go through the list that I currently have so August 15th of 2020 Arizona was approved and they are already paying Iowa said soon if not already Louisiana said they're already paying and New Mexico mid-September August 16th Colorado was approved and they're saying mid-September Missouri is already paying Utah said they're only about three weeks away, so like around mid-September. August 18th, 2020, Oklahoma was approved. They're saying mid to late September, and Montana is already paying. August 19th, 2020, we saw Maryland approved, and they're saying September 27th, and Idaho said the next couple of days. August 21st, a ton of states. Uh, as I mentioned, Massachusetts, some are already receiving the benefits. Alabama said next week. California said September 7th, and it's gonna be going out in two phases to keep an eye out on their website. Indiana said mid-September. North Carolina said next week. Email information coming out, and I actually got an update from a viewer saying that he was had payment pending from North Carolina, so that's awesome, congratulations. Um, Texas is already paying. Kentucky said early September, and Michigan said uh, that they requested that you do not contact them, they'll let you know. Uh, August 22nd, 2020, Vermont was approved and they said a few weeks. Mississippi said mid-September. Tennessee already paying. Rhode Island said mid-September. August 23rd, New York. We got the update on that a couple of weeks. Alaska, mid to late October. And Georgia said three to four weeks. August 24th, Connecticut. Uh, they will need, if you are in Connecticut, you will need to recertify and you can expect to receive LWA in mid-September. Pennsylvania is saying September 6th. Washington, to be determined, New Hampshire, early September. August 25th, 2020, we saw Maine, and we currently have no information, and Arkansas said they're weeks away. August 26th, we saw Ohio approved, and they're saying mid to late September, and Virginia, no information as of yet. August 27th, West Virginia, to be determined. August 28th, Wyoming, they said as quickly as possible, and Oregon said uh, there's, we're still gonna wait to give out some information. August 29th, 2020, Minnesota is saying that it should be probably coming out here in the next couple of weeks, maybe September 6th. Florida, they are preparing right now, but they currently don't have a date. And Hawaii said they're moving as quickly as possible, no information as of yet. August 31st, 2020, North Dakota, uh, and they're saying mid-September. September 1st, we saw Illinois, Wisconsin, and South Carolina approved. And we only have information from Wisconsin saying it's gonna take them about eight weeks. And we also saw yesterday Delaware, and Delaware already let us know that this is gonna be very complicated for them. They actually called it a nightmare to implement, so uh, they said it might take a while. Well, you guys, I hope this update was helpful. I'll be sure to keep updating you guys as information rolls out. And if you could do me a quick favor again, smash the like button, it'll just take a second. I would appreciate it. And also hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell if you would like to stay updated. And you'd like to see these videos right here where I talk about the eviction moratorium and the recent updates with stimulus package negotiations. Also too, I know there's a lot going on with the world right now and it's just good to get some positive and encouraging uh, support. So tonight, Thursday evening, we're gonna be starting up a Bible study. My buddy's gonna be leading it. If you guys are interested, it's gonna be at teachjesus.app on Facebook. You can contact the page if you'd like to be a part of the actual Zoom Bible study. And also shout out to my wife at www.nyaellaboutique.com. If you might be interested in some fashionable women's clothing, go ahead and check that out as well. Well, you guys, I hope this video was helpful. I'll continue to keep you guys up to date. I hope this reaches you well. God bless. This is Steve.